In the last lecture, we have covered two methods, pair ones and concurrent deviation method. Now, third method is scatter diagram. One more method is the Carl Pearson. But in this lecture, we will discuss this third method, scatter diagram. What is scatter diagram? Mostly theoretical questions asked on this basis. It is graphical method. You can see I have shown everything in graphical form. It is used to study only type of correlation. Direction of plotted points is used to decide type of correlation. See total we have six type of correlation. On the basis of diagram you can see what we can call it as. Now let's see the first one. That is called perfect positive correlation. Perfect positive correlation. Now the question may ask perfect co positive correlation is upward direction or downward direction. You have to remember that it is upward direction. And features are every point lies on the line. See you can see each and every point is on the line and it is upward sloping and R is positive. Just to remember it, you can say UP positive, UP Uttar Pradesh, so UP positive. So U, U stands for upward, P stands for perfect positive. Okay, so when perfect positive correlation comes, UP, so it will be upward sloping and R is positive. Next is perfect negative correlation. Now positive is over, positive is UP, upward sloping, perfect positive is upward sloping. Now next is perfect negative correlation. For this remember DP negative, DP, you all know DP. So you all use mobile so you all know DP. DP negative, D stands for downward, P perfect negative. So when DP comes it will be downward sloping. Okay, every point lies on the line. Same uh, features are there. Then line is, but line is downward. Here it was upward. UP positive, DP negative. P perfectly negative is always downward. Perfectly positive is always upward. Point lies on the line. This is common feature. Here it is positive. From the sign, you can say, you can quickly tell R is negative. We had done with the two types. That is perfectly positive correlation and perfectly negative correlation. Next, instead of perfectly, they have used only positive correlation. Now, perfectly, they have not used perfectly because now the points not on the line. Earlier it was on the line, not on the line, but it looks upward only. Still it is upward. So it is called positive correlation. Say perfectly, is in perfectly positive, they lie on the same line. Here only positive. So not on this line, but it looks upward only. The movements are upward only. And R is in that case it is plus 1 but here less than 1 but more than 0. Next, negative correlation. Same points not on the same line. But from there you can see that the movement is downward sloping. So points are downward. Earlier it was R is equal to minus 1 but now we will say that it is more than minus 1 but less than 0. Next is no correlation. From the from there only you can see the meaning no correla correlation means there is no relation at all. Uncorrelated means two um, variation variables are there. There exists no relationship. That's why there is no any sequence for this. Neither upward nor downward. 
So R is equal to zero. There is no correlation. That's why they are called as uncorrelated. Now the last one is curvy linear. Curvy. Curvy means what? It is forming curve. It's not a downward or upward sloping line, but it is in the curve form or non-linear. Linear means straight. Non-linear means not straight. So in this case, what happens? It first move upward, then go downward, or it may go first downward and then upward. Like this only. It may go downward and then upward. It's not in a straight line, so it is called curvy linear. We have done with all the types of scatter diagram. Mostly they will ask you objective type questions, theoretical questions based on it. So just go through it. Remember these shortcuts and draw the diagrams. See, remember these uh, value also, R value also. Maybe they will ask you to get confused. Uh, for example, for positive correlation, what is R? And they will provide you four options. So remember this part also.